How's it going, everybody? Ragaroth here. So, Evo happened yesterday. We got a lot of cool fighting game announcements. Actually, well, eh, it was some cool fighting game announcements. It wasn't the biggest one. It wasn't the worst one either, though. One of the, I guess, last ones that kind of caught my eye was the Street Fighter VI character reveal. Primarily one character. Uh, so, they annou officially announced Kimberly, a new character, and Jury, or Yuri. <laughs> I'm not, you know, I think that's the correct, correct pronunciation. They just always call her Jerry. And she is one of my favorite Street Fighter characters. And it's nice she's actually making the base roster this time. So I figured I was kind of obligated to do a reaction video to her trailer. And I guess Kimberly's. So let's check it out right now. <laughs> All right, so they're showing Kimberly first. Does her outfit look like Kyrene's or is it just me? I do got to say the graphics in this game. Yeah. That did look... Yeah, she has some of Kyrene's moves, I think. Got to say the graphics are incredible. Looks like she has some Kyrene stuff and like spray paint stuff? Or more ninja-ish? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, she's kind of like that uh, one new character in KOF, sort of. Okay, so she's a ninja. Now, never mind the Kyrene thing. Oh, she's got a motorcycle this time. Something wicked. Damn. I really like her hair this time. It's not like she's the same voice actress. Okay, she's got the spin back, kind of. Okay, that looks new. Okay, she's got that back. Kind of. Damn, she's just, like all in the air. Okay, well... Her super is automatically better than the super she had in Street Fighter V, though that's not very hard to beat. <laughs> Gotta have a cell phone. And only one of us is allowed to do the killing. <laughs> nice. I think I might actually like how she, because I was more of a fan of how she played in Street Fighter IV versus Street Fighter V, and... Obviously, she doesn't look exactly like either or, but I see more resemblance to Street Fighter 4 here. Though it does seem like she doesn't have any projectiles, which is kind of a shame. I did like her, I did like her the way she did her projectiles, primarily in 4, but we might not have seen her whole moveset. I'm not sure. Okay, yeah. Um, thank God Jury's back, and she's in the base roster this time once again. She looks awesome. I don't know if it's my favorite design of hers. I like her hair the most. I do kind of like the motorcycle outfit she had in Street Fighter V the most, which is funny because she's driving a motorcycle with a motorcycle helmet, but she doesn't have this, that outfit this time. Very strange, but I'd like to say she's going to have a version of that in Street Fighter VI. So yeah, um, and Kimberly looks cool too. I mean, here's the thing. I'm personally not that crazy about that sort of younger generation kind of fill-in characters. Sometimes I like them. Um, like, for instance, I wasn't that big on a lot of the combat kids in Mortal Kombat X. The only one I really liked was Takeda. Just, that's just because I just thought he was really cool. It probably helped his, I guess, two father parental figures were characters that are at least, were probably the coolest out of the parent figures of the other characters. But, I, yeah, I'm not super crazy on those. She does look neat, though. And, you know, I like that she's a ninja and the spray cans. That's all cool. And, like, and so... I guess probably I'll just address this. So I haven't really talked much about Street Fighter VI, and there's a few reasons. So Street Fighter, honestly, I like it, but it's never been my favorite fighting game. Not to mention, but when I started my channel, Street Fighter V was already kind of like 
sort of halfway, I guess, is done. And secondly, I'm just very, 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 very fatigued out on Street Fighter, especially being a fan of other Capcom fighting games like Marvel vs. Capcom, Tatsunoko vs. Capcom, Darkstalkers, things like that. And it's just very frustrating that Capcom refuses to give any of its other fighting games a chance anymore. I don't know why. I guess they just, I guess it just has to make a lot of money, and Street Fighter just makes the most money. I mean, I kind of thought Marvel vs. Capcom 3 at least did pretty good, but I, I don't know. Um, it, it's very frustrating, and it doesn't help. Like, you know, I saw the leaked roster, and I think overall, I guess I would say it is better than Street Fighter 5 just because it has Jerry and Akuma we are basically my two favorite Street Fighter characters in the base roster, at least. We think that's the whole base roster. Hopefully that is, and it's not just maybe the base roster in Season 1 of DLC. That would be a pain in the ass. And not, not to mention, like, but they just... They, they can't get over this obsession with Street Fighter 2. And, like, there's all these Street Fighter 2 characters that I'm like, I don't really want them. I don't need I'm not, They just don't appeal to me personally, and I'm kind of just very tired of them. And, I mean, I'm not saying take out Ryu, Ken, Chun-Li. Like, I, I get them. Um, it's more so like the Blancas and the Dalsims characters and E Honda. Like, why? The, I don't know. And like, the only character they're bringing back that wasn't in Street Fighter Five so far, at least, is DJ. Street Fighter Five at least started with Nash, Karine, uh, Armika, and Birdie, who eh, he grew on me. <laughs> and I've just never personally been that big of a fan of DJ. No offense to any DJ fans out there. I'm happy that you're going to get him back. He's just never been my cup of tea, really. And I was really hoping we would kind of get more Street Fighter Third Strike characters, even Alpha characters. And Jury might be the only Street Fighter Four character. And Rashid might be the only Street Fighter Five character. Just really annoying decisions. And, like, a lot of new characters who just, to me, just don't really seem that appealing. There's one or two that I saw that I liked. I think it was the older dude and the girl with, like, kind of the white hair and, like, the claws. They were the only kind of new characters that really stood out to me. And I guess the red-haired dude kind of seemed cool as well, the knuckles-looking guy. <laughs> but, yeah, so don't expect me to talk much about Street Fighter Six, honestly, at least at, at, at launch. Like, I'm going to get it at launch, but I'm honestly not that hyped, hyped for it. Maybe my mind will change as time goes on. I'll obviously do a reaction to Akuma, and maybe even Ken, just because I'm very curious how he's going to be this time, considering all the things we've heard about him. But, yeah, um, otherwise, let me know what you guys think about Jerry and Kimberly in the comments below, or Yodi. <laughs> um, like the video if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it. Definitely consider subscribing if you like this video and some of my others. But thank you so much for checking out this video, and as I always say, another time, another place. Keep being awesome.